Greetings all, the Devious Monkey here. I'm kind of in limbo. I'm stuck with ideas in my head, but I'm waiting for stuff to come in. Not that I don't have a ton of crap laying around here that I could probably shoot a video on, but I'm waiting for, and, and this has nothing to do with video, keep in mind. I'm waiting for the filter that goes on my air purifier for my bedroom. I had to order it because I couldn't get it even at Best Buy. If I ordered it from them, it would have taken even longer than if I had just ordered it from Amazon. And I was supposed to get it today, and I've been watching the tracking. It, I mean, it left out of the state this morning. It says that it got here in Virginia Beach, like, early. But there's no way that that's going to get delivered today. I mean, it's already after 4, and it doesn't even show up for delivery. So I'm not getting my filter, which means I'm breathing my old stank, dusty air tonight again. I'm also waiting for my Aperture MC4 Light Traveler's Kit, but I know that's not gonna be here until Wednesday. Can't wait to get that, because I've got a lot of things I wanna play around with. I am also waiting for the new mask that I ordered. Who knows when that's gonna get here. I got tracking for it on the 26th, but it hasn't changed status since then, it's just, label created waiting for package so whatever today i also did something i don't want to say impulsive because i've been wanting to do it for a little while now and and every day the situation just compounded itself until i was finally like screw it i'm gonna do it today and i filmed all that and i have an idea for how to turn that into a video but i don't have time to do that today so you're gonna have to wait for that I did have my team call today for my day job and it went relatively quickly and uh, you know they're I was waiting to see if they were going to extend the project out and they didn't which means now I'm, I don't have any crazy deadlines I just have normal shit to do so that takes a lot of pressure off of me because lately I've just felt under the gun of trying to, to meet deadlines and and do all that stupid day job stuff Wah! one of the other things that I have been just wrestling with well, two things. One, I still haven't built that damn exercise thing in the garage. I need to do that. The second thing, though, is all of these drawers. You know how I'm always referring to my drawers filled with crap that I've got, that I keep, that I probably shouldn't keep, that, oh, I should keep it because it all comes full circle and I might find a use for it. All right, when it gets right down to it, some of these drawers have stuff in it that is just garbage. And after this weekend, I went through every single one of these drawers, and I'm not shitting you, at least five times each. I could not find what I was looking for. In the process of going through these drawers and not finding what I actually needed at the time, I found a bunch of other shit that I have been looking for in the past and couldn't find. So I think tomorrow I am going to take these out one at a time, I'm going to dump them, and I am literally going to be very, very liberal in my throwing away and say, all right, do I need it? Do I not? I mentioned last week that I had some LED lights. They were both so old, one of them had either on or off. And the battery thing was broken and it wouldn't even hold the battery on. So I had to, I had to smush the battery into it while I was holding it to see what kind of light I was getting. And it was just ridiculous. So I did throw that one away. I found another one in the drawer in there. And for some reason, even though I've got another drawer filled with probably 10 different kinds of batteries, none of them fit. So I'm wondering to myself, since I don't throw shit away, especially batteries, what the hell did I power that thing with? Like it, it doesn't even have a place to plug it in with external power, with like a cord. It just has this battery thing in there. It's got a little dial so that you can turn it up and, and sort of adjust it, but it's just, again, it's like when LEDs first started coming out and being popular. So, I mean, I didn't even live here at the time. So it's better than six years old. I'm, I'm guessing it's going on 10 years old. So it's, it's junk, it needs to be thrown away. That's how these drawers are. I mean, other than some drawers that are specific that have things in it, there's just, it's almost like I just took stuff and I threw it into a drawer that had space. So there's just tons of junk drawers. And I try to sort of keep things together, but then when I'm throwing shit out, and I mean, not throwing it out, but when I'm dumping it, trying to find something, that's when everything just starts getting thrown back into drawers, you know, because you're always like, oh, I'll do it later. And then you don't do it, and now you've got 18 junk drawers filled with crap, and you don't know where the hell anything is. 
So I do believe that tomorrow I am going to sit down and I'm going to go through every one of these damn drawers. I'm going to throw shit away that I'm like, some of the stuff, I'm like pulling things out and I'm like, what the hell is that? I don't even know what it is. I don't even know what it was a part of. So how could it possibly be useful to me? It all goes. But I have a feeling that probably 75% of what I find that I'm not going to keep, it's going to get thrown away. And that's just the way it goes. I cannot, I cannot deal with, with this many drawers. I need to get rid of this stuff. So tomorrow's going to be the great purge. I may film that because you might actually get a kick out of some of the old ass dumb shit that's in there that are like, what was, what was he thinking buying that? So that's, that's kind of where I'm going with it. So this morning I got up, I just didn't feel like cooking anything. I do need to go grocery shopping like I do every other damn day. I didn't feel like making anything. I didn't even feel like making oatmeal. So I ate cereal and had a cup of coffee for breakfast before my team call. Then after my team call, I was kind of doing stuff. And then eventually I had to go ship something to a friend of mine. And while I was out, I went to three ships and I got coffee. The point of telling you all this is that while I was running around and doing all this shit and then starting on the project that I filmed to do for another day, I just realized because I don't feel right, I forgot to eat. So I haven't eaten all day except for that bowl of cereal like early this morning. And then I had a shit ton of caffeine. So I've kind of got that I haven't eaten anything and I've had too much caffeine sort of like meh. And that ain't cool. But kids don't do that because now I kind of feel a little lightheaded, dizzy-ish, goofy, monkey. But more importantly, I'm hangry. And I didn't realize it until stupid little things around here started pissing me off. I spent a lot of years being hangry because I wouldn't eat anything all day and then I just kept drinking cup after cup after cup after cup of coffee and that's not cool. I did not have a coffee milkshake today which was delicious because I don't want to get it in my head that I can just keep making those and drinking them otherwise I'm going to get even bigger because I'm just going to keep drinking coffee milkshakes all the time. I'm going to leave those as a once in a while treat. Okay, so today was a big video about absolutely nothing other than me whining about how messed up my drawers are and how I have too much shit and I need to throw it away. So I just sort of wanted to put that out there so that I'm held accountable by all of you guys to clean those damn drawers. Enough of me blabbering on about how messy my drawers are and how I'm hangry. As always, thanks for joining me. Like, subscribe, and all that shit. And remember, kids, forward and up.